Hi guys, so in the last session we have seen how we can run the different test ng suit uh, XML files using the Jenkins parameters. So same kind of scenario uh, we will see in this session. This time uh, we will run the automation on different browsers using the Jenkins parameters and Maven command. Okay, so this is quite a normal and a basic scenario in the automation to run our automation on different browsers like Chrome, Firefox or Edge. So there should be a browser parameter that I will send to my test case from outside of the test case. Okay, we should not hard code our browser parameter. So that parameter I am going to send from our Jenkins job. Okay, so for that purpose, uh, we will have to create a Jenkins parameter job and in that we will create a browser parameter. So whatever browser I will select from that Jenkins job, our automation will run on that browser. So first let's see the Jenkins parts and then we will see our uh, Maven project setup. So this is the project we have created in the last session. So in this we are selecting the sanity or regression suit that we want to run. Okay, so in that I am going to add one more parameter that is browser. So go to the configure, click on add parameter, then choice parameter. And this parameter will have three choices. So Chrome, Firefox and Edge. So you can increase your choices as per your requirement on Safari browser or any other browser. So select browser on which you want to run the automation. That's it. So we are going to run our local Maven project. So select none here. So we need to change our uh, Maven command as well. So before that, uh, let me apply and save this project. So first let's see the uh, setup of our Maven project. Whatever changes we need to do for this in our Maven project. So same Maven project uh, we are going to use which we have created in the last session. So this contains the regression test case and sanity test cases and regression test suit and sanity suit XML. Okay, so what things we need to do? So in the form.xml file we need to add one more property that is browser property. Right, so for running different suit XMLs we have created the suit file property. So for running automation on the different browsers we need to create the browser property. Okay, so you can give any name to this property. So it should be a meaningful. So I have given the browser property. Okay, so by default value for this property will be Chrome. That means if you are running on the local machine and if you directly run with the MUN clean test, this automation will run on the Chrome browser. So because you are not giving any value to your browser property. So by default value is Chrome. So here I am using the latest version of the Selenium to avoid the use of your drawer manager for our browser setup. So value for this browser property we need to use in this sure fire plugin. So this is the configuration we have done for the different suit XMLs, right? So in the same way we need to define our browser property. So for that purpose under the configuration define system property variables. Okay, in this tag and inside that tag create a browser property. So what will be the value for this browser property? That is we have given with the dollar curly bracket. So whatever value for this browser property user will give here, that value will be used in the sure path plugin. So next step is we need to use the value for this browser property, okay, in our test ng class. Okay, so depending upon the value for this browser property, we will open the different browsers. So how we can access the uh, value for this browser property in the test ng Java class? So here I have created the browser setup. This is the test ng class so here i have defined the before method okay so before running my sanity or regression test i need to open the browser first okay so that's why i have used the test ng before method annotation here so in the open browser what we are doing first we need to get the property value okay browser property value so that you can do with the help of system dot get property and whatever property name Okay, system.get property and this is our property name that we have defined in the form.xml file. This one. So same name we need to provide in the test ng class. System.get property and name of the property whose value you want in this test ng class. So as of now by default value from this form.xml file will be Chrome. So that value will be passed over here. So our browser will become the Chrome. So we will print that value in the console so that we can verify. So this is normal if else block for the different browsers. Check the browser if it is Chrome then open the Chrome browser. If it is Firefox then open the Firefox. If not then at the end open the edge. So in order to access the before method 
from this browser setup you need to extend that class over here so let's verify all these changes on the local machine first and then we will run from our jenkins job so let's run this form.xml file with the maven test directly so i'm not sending any value for this property using the maven command so both the by default value for suit file and browser property will be used while running this maven project so you can see it has used the chrome property value we are just opening the browser and we are closing the browser in each test engine method. Now let's run this automation on some different browsers. So for that just copy this property name and right click, go to run as, enable build. So in the goal section provide clean test and hyphen D your property name that is browser property equal to its value. So let's say age. So click on run. So our setup is working fine on the local machine. So let's run this project from the Jenkins job now. So again go to the configure. So in the root form just provide your location of your main project uh, which you want to run. Okay. And in the goal section clean install hyphen d suit file. So this is our first property that we have used in the pom.xm file for running the different test engine suit. Space hyphen d another property that is our browser property okay so name of our property equal to dollar curly bracket and whatever value user will select for this parameter browser that value will be used in the maven command so curly bracket and provide the browser so as per user choice user will select the value for this browser and that will be used over here so click on apply and save so now in this parameter job we got two options to select one is type of sanity suit you want to run so let's run the sanity and what browser on which you want to run the automation okay so by default value will be chrome so let's run on the chrome first click on build so test got completed on the chrome browser and all those test cases are from the sanity suit so let's run on the firefox this time so select regression let's say and browser is firefox click on build so test cases are executing on the firefox browser from the regression suit okay so everything is working on our local machine and same is working from our jenkins parameterized job as well okay so try these things on your own and let me know if you face any issue in this thank you